every step quicker than the last My feet tread down this beaten path And I'll keep, keep One of the major factors that influenced me to have my son instead of having an abortion, like what society says, is that I knew he was a little human that had unexpectedly come into my life, but he was a life nonetheless. And so I, I instantly knew to embrace him and everything that I could do to protect him, and which he actually saved my life because I was going through suicidal thoughts at that time. I was in an abusive relationship and though he was conceived in rape and I was at my wit's end with all the stressors that were going on, I knew that he was a person and it became us against the world instead of me against him. And so I, I took up a new purpose in my moment of thinking that life was over and knew that my life, my purpose was to fight for his. Yeah, I get up. My son means everything to me. Not only did he come into my life in a pivotal moment, but just who he is and the essence of who he is. The way he loves people is, is amazing. And the funny thing is, um, he was speech delayed up until about five, five and a half years, but he had this amazing way of loving people. And he did that without prejudice of anyone. He, he, I remember when we were at a park uh, and there, there were these parents pushing their disabled son in a stroller type wheelchair. And my son saw him and greeted him like he was the biggest rock star, just waving and smiling. And this, the disabled guy, he, his hand was a little bit crippled and I remember he raised it up and he was waving. And, they had that interaction. Um, and just the way that he will see someone who's scruffy or homeless to the side that's invisible to others, he will just go out of his pathway and go up to them and greet them and love on them. Yeah, I, get up, I, get up, and I, I honestly find my strength in God. And I don't say that to sound cliche. I know to a lot of people that it does, but humans are gonna let you down in many ways, sometimes in every way possible. We let ourselves down. And I know that in a society where we shout our own strengths and that we are the only ones that can do this for ourselves and that we are the only ones that can make this happen, you know, we're fallible and we make mistakes. And when we can own up to that and know that there is hope beyond ourselves and people and when we make our passion about others and loving them the way that God loves us and the way he did everything in his strength and power to sacrifice for us there's hope in throwing focus off ourselves and loving people and God is faithful the same way in our lives and and knowing that I could trust in him in the midst of any hurt and any pain that I've encountered in life, which has been many. He's always been consistent in carrying me through, and I'm passionate about you knowing that for yourself as well, his love for you. Lift me back to solid ground.